you guys, it is Kevin here, the Busan Kevin channel with a Life in Japan video. Now, the Life in Japan series of videos are ones I've been making on my JLand Kev channel. That's my other blog channel, and the link is below to that, or you can click the annotation. <clears throat> I've got over 30 Life in Japan videos. And the deal is with my Life in Japan videos, the one shot, one take, no editing, they go up online, it's about different aspects of life in Japan. So, um, today, I want to kind of revisit a topic I, I brought up in a video last week on my Jalen Kev channel, and that's with regards to working late in Japan. Now, when you arrive in Japan, <clears throat> if you've read about Japan, you'll know that Japanese people tend to work late. They work much later than their counterparts in North America, Europe, wherever it may be. <clears throat> and it's not just Japan, but it's also something you'll find across Asia, a lot of parts of Asia, Korea, China. Now, for Japan, um, it's, it's very interesting, and I've been thinking about this because I have been working quite late the last week or two, and I have been working late because simply um, I've got a lot of work to do, and I just simply can't finish it by the time uh, my shift is over. And that happens with people. I mean, I, I used to work in the IT industry in Canada. I worked in game development. And if we were to have some kind of a beta or alpha version of a game we were working on, our team um, if it was due soon, we had to stay late. It was just that simple. But in Japan, often, people stay late at work even if they have no work to do. And you think, well, that sounds pretty unproductive. It is. Um, <clears throat> a lot of people in Japan, again, they tend to stay at work late because it's about a show. It's about, they feel, many people feel that if they stay late, <clears throat> their co-workers and others will think, it gives the appearance that they're doing a lot of work. Um, and I've had coworkers I've done in the past, Japanese coworkers, who would who would brag about, oh, to be Kevin, I was at work until ten o'clock last night, or I was at work until ten thirty. And then some nights when I would actually stay late, in, you know, uh, in, in the office working, and I would actually watch them work, I would realize that they were chatting with each other, they were ordering out food and sitting around and eating and nibbling on food and chatting. They were on the computer, um, you know, checking online shopping websites, and they were and then do a little bit of work, and then kind of hang out and chat more, and eat ice cream. So basically, they were at work late, but they weren't doing very much. They honestly could have left hours earlier. Um, and that's one thing, uh, a lack of productivity. And I don't know, I sometimes think that that's probably a reason why companies like Apple, um, Google, are the ones that are kind of taking over the world, and uh, Japanese companies that once were big in the 1980s. Companies like Sony and things like that, that's why they're falling by the wayside now and they're not doing so well. I think that there's a, a definitely a lack of productivity in general. It's kind of a culture of unproductivity. Um, and if, you know, if, if a lot of people, if you've worked for a Japanese company, you may agree with me. Some of you may not agree with me, but in my opinions. Um, something else that is very interesting and, and very frustrating for Japanese people also, uh, especially if you're a young office worker or company worker or salary man, a new company worker, is that often you are supposed to stay at work until those above you leave. Essentially, if you leave work before your seniors, again, those above you, your managers, um, it reflects poorly upon you. And people may even be looked over for promotions because they're considered lazy if they leave early. When I say early, I mean like leaving on their shift. If their shift is from 9 to 6 and they leave at 6.10 or 6.20, that's considered early often. And um, I can think when I, when I worked in Korea and I taught adults and they would explain this to me, even they would say often their managers would be just sitting there shuffling paper and not actually doing anything because the managers had to have this illusion that they work hard and they stay late. And all of the people under them have to pretend that they're busy until their managers are done. So basically you have all of these people, managers and people under them sitting around in the office not doing anything. Very unproductive. And they're not getting paid overtime for this, they're on salary. And that um, frustrates people to no end, of course. So there you go, working late in Japan. Japanese people do work late, and of course there are people who do have to legitimately work late because they have a lot of work to do. But again, you'll find that a lot of the people who work late in Japan, they're just there desk warming. All right guys, thank you for watching another Life in Japan video. This series, um, for the last 30 some videos has been on the Jalen Kev channel again uh, check the link below to my blog channel almost a thousand videos there about Japan 
and uh, I'm going to start putting those videos, a lot of them, not all, but, uh, but I'm going to start putting more life in Japan videos here on the Busan Kevin channel. So check the links below. Go like my Facebook page, guys. My Facebook page, a lot of cool stuff happening there. I put a lot of, a lot of news links about Japan, just a lot of like, opinion pieces and videos I like. So there's a lot of fun stuff happening there. Good community on the Busan Kevin Facebook page. Again, click the link below. Go like it. And uh, if you like this video, of course, click the like button below. Share it with your friends. And leave a comment. I'd love to hear some topics that you would like for me to cover in the Life in Japan series. And for more videos, again, go to the Jayland Kev channel. Um, there's a playlist with more than 30 videos in the Life in Japan series. All right, take care. Kevin here in Japan.